everybody, what's up guys, Ramsey here at the Google Fiber event. Talk about an exciting day for Kansas City. So here are the details. It's not actually out. Uh, in fact, only the announcement was made. And here's, here's what's going to happen. It is actually more than just Google Fiber. It is Google Fiber TV as well, meaning they're not only launching high-speed internet, but they're also launching a TV service, which is killer. Uh, but here's how it's gonna work. Uh, you pay anywhere from 70 bucks to $120 to get the service. It actually includes a set-top box and a network box and all these different pieces of hardware you need to run it in your house. But the truth is, is no one will get this unless your neighborhood rallies between now and September 9th to actually get Google Fiber. You have to have about 40 or 50 people signed up. If you go to google.com forward slash rally, uh, I'm sorry, sorry, forward slash fiber, um, your neighborhood can sign up to petition, essentially, to get Google Fiber. And if you get enough people signed up, Google will consider coming to your neighborhood and installing it. Um, and so the way that uh, all of this is gonna work, if your neighborhood is picked and selected, um, is a $300 install fee, which will be waived in the first year for people who sign up, which is pretty cool, the, the fact that they're doing that. But the big surprise is, at the $120 package, you get uh, the Nexus 7 tablet, and that actually controls um, Google Fiber TV. Now, all of the demos that they showed about how fast this service is, it's amazing to watch. They actually had some videos of people uploading photos, people uploading video, and it was really, really quick. Uh, and they compared it to traditional broadband, and it was no comparison. So, this is a huge curveball. If you were sitting in the audience um, here at the announcement, there were a lot of gasp and oohs and ahs because this was not at all expected. And uh, you know, you kind of have to wonder if, if later this year when Apple does their announcements uh, in October likely happening, um, if within iPhone 5 and, and, um, and those announcements, if there's any plans um, for an update to their perhaps their TV service. The way that Google Fiber TV is going to work is that pretty much the traditional cable TV channels will be broadcasted. It's all HD. Um, and it's actually integrated with Netflix, which is really, really cool and really slick. Um, all of it is searchable, but keep in mind, their traditional Google TV service that they have now, the, the hardware you can buy, um, and some of them have built into the TV sets like Sony and Samsung, uh, all of that Google TV uh, product is separate than Google TV Fiber. So this is really, really uh, interesting that they're trying to sort of play in this area in a test market uh, here in Kansas City. So a really proud day for anyone here who's here in Kansas City because this was a huge tech announcement, a really fun one at that. Uh, and frankly, when you're in this room, it doesn't look like you're in Kansas City. I mean, this feels like uh, being in Palo Alto and, um, or, or somewhere in the valley. So what a fun day uh, for Kansas City, and, and I can't wait to see uh, it unveiled and rolled out.